Praise the Lord. Um, good morning, good afternoon, whatever it may be, wherever you are. Uh, Pastor Ali Grady III here. I just wanted to do a quick video this morning. Um, a lot of things going on in this world today. You know, we, we had the uh, Syrian chemical weapon attack, which killed a lot of civilians and babies, killed 82 or more. I'm not sure what the exact count is, but it was a, a very hideous attack by President Assad of Syria uh, on his own people. And I know a lot of people are outraged about it. I'm outraged about it because it's tragic and I really believe that every life matters. But the people that are outraged about it, which is a lot of people, rightly so, as I said before, if you live in the United States of America, why aren't you outraged about the chemical warfare taking place in the wombs of women in the United States of America via abortion? You know, they use chemicals to kill babies, to kill the babies in the womb. They also do suction. There's a different techniques that they use to take lives. And, you know, 72 people were killed or 80, whatever, in Syria. But do you realize that there's 3,000 babies that are killed a day in the United States of America. And to me, that's outrageous. That is just an outrage because the reality of it is, is that I do believe that all lives matter. And why do I believe that? Because I believe that mankind is created in the image of God. And when we take a life, we're attacking the very image of the creator that made us. Every life matters. Every life is important. Do you understand that, uh, Every life has a purpose. It doesn't matter the circumstances which cause that life to be conceived. It, you know, sometimes they're very terrible circumstances, but every life is important. Nobody's a mistake. No child in the womb is a mistake. That child is a priceless original created by God with a purpose and a destiny to do something in their generation and in their time. And if we don't value that, then we, we don't value the, the one that truly should be valued, the one that loves us, the one that made us, the one that knows us better than we know ourselves, um, you know, mighty God. You know, God is so in love with us. You know, it's, it amazes me when I think about God, uh, how much he loves me, you know, how much he loves all of us. He loves us when we're good. He loves us when we're bad. He loves us when we do right. He loves us when we do wrong. Um, he loves us and he knows us and he knows the purpose that he put it on us on this planet for and nobody should be able to tell okay this this life doesn't matter so um, you know this one doesn't count but every single life counts and you know we got to stand up for what is for what is for against evil you know the mur murder is evil no matter how you slice it uh, it's evil and, you know, we need to stand up for these innocent babies that can't stand up for themselves. Um, I've been all over the world and, uh, you know, I was in Ireland a number of years ago and there was a big uh, question of whether abortion will be legalized in Ireland. It wasn't at that time, but I believe it currently is. And, um, you know, it was, it, was, it was a battle. You know, it's a battle between good and evil. And, you know, it, it's, I just believe it's something that we need to stand up for. You know, we can't be silent in the midst of evil and just not and say, you know, say evil's not evil. You know, it's, we got to stand up to it. And, um, it's just a fact of life. And, uh, you know, I hope and I pray that, uh, that abortion will come to an end, that people will understand, uh, somebody posted something on my Facebook page. I posted something about, about, uh, this and someone said, well, you know, it's, it's, you know, it's apple and oranges, but it's not apple and oranges. Life, every human life is important. Every human life matters. So, uh, I just wanted just to, to encourage you, um, you know, to stand up for what's right. You know, there's a saying that I like to say, and it's like, don't drink the Kool-Aid, you know. Um, Kool-Aid is what, when people tell you something and you, you believe it, even though it isn't true. You know, people say they don't know when life begins. Uh, I'm not sure when life begins. You know, life begins at conception. The moment the egg and the sperm get together, that's when life begins. That's where we all started. We all started there, you know, and... Um, so anybody that would say different is lying and they want you to believe their lie.
but don't believe their lie. Don't drink the Kool-Aid and don't add on by making the Kool-Aid by c continuing to tell the lie that, that goes against all logic. You know, it's a scientific fact. Um, you know, abortion stops a beating heart. Um, I love you guys. Uh, God bless you. Have a great week, um, and I'll see you next time. Pastor Ali Grady III, God bless.